Eurasia and Salim Abdul Karim are a wife and husband super team who have devoted their careers to tackling the AIDS pandemic by defining the drivers of heterosexual transmission, identifying preventive and treatment approaches, developing worldwide policies, and fighting misinformation. The caliber of their work and courage to speak truth to power have made them global leaders in public health. Curatia and Salim met in the 1980s at the University of KwaZulu-Natal. While studying in the U.S., they witnessed the devastating effect HIV was having in New York. After returning home in the late 1980s, they were among the first researchers to investigate the patterns and prevalence of HIV transmission in South Africa. In the 1990s, they reported extremely high rates of HIV infection in teenage girls and much lower rates in boys. These results suggested that sexual relationships between teenage girls and older men were fueling the escalating transmission rate in Africa. This observation kick-started a mission. The Abdul Karims decided to develop means by which the girls could protect themselves. In 2002, they founded the Center for the AIDS Program of Research in South Africa, or CAPRISA for short, a multi-institutional, independent, non-profit AIDS research organization. They demonstrated that use of a vaginal antiretroviral gel could decrease rates of sexually transmitted HIV and empower women and girls to control their risk. This success reflected 18 years of work and was a significant advance in HIV prevention. It paved the way for the development of antiretroviral pre-exposure prophylaxis, or PrEP, now widely used around the world to prevent infection. In the meantime, South Africa was also struggling with high mortality rates from TB and HIV co-infection. The Caprisa team determined optimal timing of drug treatments. This regimen cut co-infection deaths in half, and the World Health Organization immediately adopted the approach. Throughout their careers, the Abdul Karims have helped guide international health policy. In South Africa, they established five research centers and trained hundreds of infectious disease scientists. When COVID-19 struck, this infrastructure building paid off, enabling the country to quickly pivot to tackle a new microbial scourge. Curatia and Salim Abdul Karim have dedicated their lives to advancing science, translating research findings into policy, educating the public on crucial health issues, and overturning false narratives in international media. Through their work, they have risen as powerful voices for global health. <laughs>